All right, what's going on everyone? Doc here, and today I've got some war season rewards to open. Really, really happy with my alliance's performance this past season. Um, this Because of the uh, war, the rating reduction being cut in half, uh, my alliance started in tier 3. And due to a ton of wins, 7 in a row, or 6 in a row actually, so we went 7 and 2 on the season, we ended up in plot 1 and also in now in tier 1. So I've got two six stars to open up and three five stars as well. Plus I'll open up all the T5 CC here. All right, so let's get started, I guess. Uh, form to T5 basic. So I'm, I'm a little bit on the overflow on the T5 base. Uh, yeah, T5 basic right now, uh, but that's all right. So I'm going to spin out one of the T5 CC crystals and I'm gonna pop open the rest. All right, we started the recorder because it looked a little bit laggy here. I wanna make sure that I'm not spoiling any of the, any of the openings before it actually shows on screen here. Uh, like I said, just gonna do one of the T5CC first. Pop it real quick. Looking for Mystic, really, because uh, Mystic gets me closer to that Black Widow Clairvoyant. It's gonna roll over though into Cosmic. That's all right. Uh, I do have, so, my best six stars now, Black Widow Clairvoyant, uh, Cat Marvel Movie, who's now at rank two, and then also Aegon. Um, no Mystic at all. A lot of, lot of um, Cosmic, not bad, some um, skill. Mew and I have started to build up on, I don't really need that, and Tech, I really have some built up. No Tech Champions, of course, though. All right, so then we'll just hop straight into the, we'll go for the five stars first, and going for basics. Um, so I, like I said, I do have a six star eight on, I pulled him out of my, out of two five stars, two six stars ago. So, uh, to get him duped though, would take a while, still definitely would be happy with a five star egg on here. Uh, other than that, a five star ghost, uh, would be interesting. Uh, maybe duping my Heimdall or Iceman has been a very long time coming. Um, and honestly, I'm not really sure what other five stars I really need outside of that. Um, just champions that are very, very good. A Namor dupe. Okay. So I got Namor last season rewards. Um, I brought him out to rank three, but I haven't really done much with him. I still don't have a lot of six stones for him, but maybe I can start considering bringing him up now that he is duped. And... I wouldn't need to use the generic Awakening Gym on him as well. So that's really, really good. All right. Next one here. Um, yeah, that, that that's probably the best this uh, will, this opening will go. Last season rewards went really well for every, everything, but the six star was uh, Dark Hawk, so it wasn't that bad, and the five stars were phenomenal. Archangel again. This guy is now going to be SIG 80 because I just got him to SIG 60 in a Grandmaster, or yeah, in a Grandmaster Crystal. I've been duping him so much. Uh, so a lot of mutants today already. I'm not too big a fan of Archangel. My, my alliance told me that I was, I was wrong for that yesterday, which I don't blame him. I know a lot of people like him, but I don't know. Just having so many champions immune to either bleed or poison kind of diminishes his value for me but that might that might just be me last one here uh another dupe on my gladiator hulk i think he's like 660 70 somewhere around there yeah he's well 66 so he's 86 now um so lots of iso i guess that's good i can always use some iso uh really happy with the namor dupe though uh because yeah i think i have like 30 or 40 generic six stones that i can consider putting into him all right, here's the big one, the six stars. If the six stars are anything like the five stars, I'll be pretty happy. Uh, like I said, Aegon dupes number one, but I'm pretty sure that's not gonna happen. So I'm putting in my number one as the Cat Marvel movie dupe. Most of her utility is behind her dupe. Uh, Black Widow Clairvoyant dupe would be great as well. Cause like I said, I'm, bringing, I'm planning on bringing her up to rank two. First one is slowing down here. And it's going to be ending on a Spider Gwen. Nice. Okay. I don't have her as a five star. I really am not super experienced with using her. Uh, but I'm really happy to pull her and try her out. That's great. Okay. 
Uh, yeah, I've been kind of wanting her for her uh, controllable evade because it doesn't trigger when you're um, blocking. So you can kind of make sure that you know when it's going to trigger on special attacks, that kind of stuff. You, even Spark doesn't have that ability. So I'm, I'm really happy with the Spider Gwen there. Uh, and the last one here, let's see. Slowing down, like I said, Aegon Dupe. Not Massacre. Human Torch. Damn. All right. I already have this guy as a five star rank four, but a six star is abyss worthy. Um, two science champions, but some really, really good science champions. Now, two new six stars might have just put me over. There it is. One million total base hero rating on my account. Uh, I was at 993,000 before this opening. So I've got to take a screenshot of that, actually, while I'm thinking about it. And 550 champions as well. So, overall, really happy with that. Um, not sure if either of those are rank 3 worthy, but I think I'm super far away on, um, on some um, science T5CC anyways. So, my 6-star roster right now... Um, Black Widow, Cat Marvel, Movie are my only rank 2s. Gamora is sig 40, because I pulled her out of the compensation shards. Uh, and you can see Aegon there. And adding Torch and Spider Gwen to that, not bad. Uh, the reason I have been thinking about using the 5-star Torch, though, is because I can awaken him uh, if I wanted to. Um, just, to get the, just to have the ability to kind of get back his uh, pre-fight and not really have to... Um, it, it basically would be avoiding the mistakes, so I might still bring the five star because of that. Uh, just in case, Archangel, you can see there, and Namor at Sig 20. I have a little bit of um, five star Sig stones for him, but I probably won't do anything until I can bring him straight to Sig 200. Although I could rank five him, he really needs, he really takes the benefit out of max Sig. Last thing I want to show is my T5CC here. Uh, where is it? Yeah, so I'm maxed on the basics, and like I said, get, Mystic is still my furthest along. I have some Cosmic Mutant, only a little bit of science, a little bit of skill as well, and Tex at 11 for, or 1400. Really don't have anyone for that as well, but luckily the two that I'm building up the most, I have champions for. Uh, so that's going to do it for this video. I want to go to uh, Spider Gwen because I really don't know much about Spider Gwen. I know some people really like her. Uh, I think she can hit really hard, I believe, though. Um, so I am excited to try her out uh, ever since her buff came through. Yeah, that's going to do it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed. Thank you for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video.